even individual medical practitioners have committed fraud worth multiple millions of dollars. On April 1, 2016, Sharon Iglehart, 58, a former attending psychiatrist at Riverside General Hospital, Riverside, of Houston, was sentenced to 144 months in prison by U.S. District Judge Erwin Werlein, Jr. of the Southern District of Texas. Judge Werlein also ordered Inglehart to pay $6,363,528 in restitution and to forfeit the same amount. According to evidence presented at trial, from 2006 until June 2012, Iglehart and others engaged in a scheme to defraud Medicare by submitting through Riverside approximately 158 million US dollars in false and fraud fraudulent claims to Medicare for partial hospitalization program, PHP services, an intensive outpatient treatment for severe mental illness. The evidence presented at trial showed that the Medicare beneficiaries for whom Riverside billed Medicare did not receive PHP services. In fact, evidence proved that most of the Medicare beneficiaries rarely saw a psychiatrist and did not receive intensive psychiatric treatment at all. In addition, evidence presented at trial showed that Iglehart personally billed Medicare for individual psychotherapy and other treatment purportedly provided to patients at Riverside locations, treatment that she never provided. Furthermore, Iglehart falsified the medical records of patients at Riverside's inpatient facility to make it appear as if she provided psychiatric treatment, psychiatric treatment when none was provided. On September the 10th, 2015, following a seven-day trial, a jury convicted Sharon Iglehart of one count of conspiracy to commit health care fraud, one count of health care fraud, and three counts of making false statements relating to health care matters. Please hit the subscribe button if you want to learn more about the myths and corruption surrounding medicine. It's a little image of a Neanderthal on the bottom right of your screen. Also, please indicate whether you like or dislike this video.